as well as some players that came over from Provo Preds, as that one's tapped right in front of Ambrose. And luckily it goes wide, picked off right at the blue line. That happened last night and turned into a goal, as it did tonight, too. Same type of play, Austin McHale played for the Atlanta Capitals last year in the NA3HL in Hamilton, New Jersey. He gets another one here to get Nashville on the board first. And it was kind of a similar play to what Mikhail did last. He's down in position, but the puck looked like it never made it to the goal. Another one caught at the blue line. The Mavs got to get stronger on getting the puck out of their zone as this one again ends up. Same st story, different names. Picked off again at the blue line, not cleared out of the zone. Ends up in the back of the net. Not a story we want to be repeating all season long, but unfortunately it is the way things have started here for a 2-0 Nashville lead. Through. A nice pass up forward. Brings it in, shot, had it a goal! The Mavs get on the board just as we said. Charlie Nelson, who joins the team from the Maine Moose 18U AAA, the Tri State Spartans 16U and 18U before that. Ricks here in the USPHL Premier League. As this puck comes in, front shot, pad, rebound, goal! Hunter Gentz. Yes, he's healthy. Yes, he's feeling good. And yes, he's got his first goal of the season. The alternate captain taps that one in. Columbus and Buffalo uh, really going to beat things up with, with Metro and Toledo still being some of the prime of the, of the league. Both of those two teams finished in the top 10 of the league last year. And unfortunately, this one pops out just as they got the game tied up. A loose puck pops out behind Bryson Stern. He didn't see it, but the Nashville player who was behind the goal did. And it ends up in the back of the net. So 16-22. Nashville in and it gets pinched through and out. And coming the other way is Imkin. He gets the puck in front and puts it in the net down low. Oh my, oh my, Gus Simpkin. He's able to pop that one in. The St. Louis Junior Blue from the NA3HL gets another one here to give his team a two goal lead. Number 80, Gus Simpkin. After the Zalka penalty shot at 11-17 of the third, it's really kind of been a, kind of a, a, a slow, muddy game the rest of the way here with a couple of injuries, a couple of players going down. Stern takes that shot and it ends up. He made the initial save, but the rebound pops out to the side and ends up in the back of the net. And Austin McCallie, who was shot Earlier uh, seems to be okay back on the ice. Luckily he doesn't have a severe knee, his knee injury as it looked.